What's up, lad? Let's have a fight. Okay. Oh my god. He does so much damage. That is next level. Oh my... Good thing I didn't waste a dragon blood. <laughs> That's three times. Three times he used that kick and three times my brain went, Oh no! What do I do? And I didn't do anything. Three times. That's pretty bad. <laughs> oh, rip experience. Oh, and Sen. Ah, fudge. I should have bought a light coin purse before doing this. Oh well, it's done now. I don't know if I've got a chance here. <laughs> but I'm sure as shit gonna give it a few tries. Wish there was a bit of a faster way of getting back to it. Okay, that's good. He just didn't push off that time. Okay, now he's just... Am I just too close to that wall? Here we go. Okay. Pruning. So what's he asking for? It's a, it's his foot. So is that a thrust or is that something I need to dodge? Can I Makiri counter his foot? I guess we'll have to try. <laughs> okay, get down here, man. Let's a bit more space, yeah. I can. Lovely. Okay. He can super posture break me. He's relentless, man. Fucking hell. Yeah, I'm uh, not sure this is going to happen. <laughs> it's like there's you don't have an opening. I keep looking for an opening that I can like throw firecrackers or something, but dear god. Imagine if this guy wasn't optional. <laughs> oh, come on. If you're going to put a wall jump mechanic in your game, don't make it so that you can just bounce off the wall and not wall jump. I'm going to take these fucking bamboo things. I'm going to shove them under your fingernails, mate. See, I like that. Man, I got one hit off of that. Are you serious? Oh my god. That is insanity. Probably just supposed to get really good at parrying. Oh 
Oh my good lord. Okay, it's feeling possible. It's feeling more possible. Shit. Less possible. <laughs> oh, I pressed B. I pressed B. It didn't do it. That's weird. I think it's because my camera wasn't aimed towards him, maybe, even though I was locked on. That's a bit rubbish, but I did press it. But that felt a lot more doable that time, for sure. Pretty sure if he'd just done the Makiri counter. Might have been in with a shot. Huh, they didn't see me that time. They've seen me every single time I've jumped off that branch, apart from that time. Why? Oh, come on. Stop jumping vertically up. Okay. Got a bit of space going. Okay. Okay. I'm ready. I'm ready. Hello, motherfucker. Round four. Fight. Oh, I... Okay, what is going on with this Makiri counter then? Because I pressed it again then. Nothing. It was a no-can-do. Pressing block, hello? What? I don't understand this game sometimes. I was holding block that entire time and he was hitting me through it. How? This is going way worse than last time. That's disappointing. Because I was. Is it because he broke my posture? Can you not Makiri counter if you've just had your posture broken? That might be it. That might be it. Because that's like three Makiri counters in a row that I've pressed and it hasn't. Oh no, not in a row. I did get one off. But I'm pressing them all at the exact same time. Like, he charges it up, you wait a second, and then you press it, and it works. So, uh, yeah, it must just be when he's just recently posture broke you. Makiri just doesn't do anything. Okay. Round five. Just as soon as... Oh, fuck off. There we go. Just as soon as I break these bamboo things again... Bitch. Oh, fuck off. I got stuck on that shitting thing.
Okay. That was a sweep. Another fucking Makiri, goddammit. What is... Did I get... I don't pay enough attention to my posture bar. Because it must have been broken again. Because I again did the thing, and again it didn't work. Hello? Oh boy. We're getting this dude. <laughs> we are getting this dude. It is happening. I haven't had a run as good as like the run a few runs ago where I got like half out. That's depressing. Okay, it's got to happen sooner or later. God damn it. Round six. Fight. That's interesting. Why did he dodge? I didn't press dodge, I pressed Makiri camera. Okay, I'm pressing... Oh, fuck off with that. Oh, come on. That's such bullshit. That's twice that I've been locked onto him, done my attack, and it hasn't connected. Through the power of magic. Okay, I don't understand. I'm let- Is my controller just balked because I'm letting go of the left stick, but it's dodging instead of mercurying. It definitely is the posture break thing. It definitely is the posture break thing. God damn. Because again there, hit it. Perfect timing. Doesn't happen. Oh shit, wait, that's a new one. The war-torn mob. Oh, that'll be the other memorial mob. That'll be the one we just found. Absolute rip. I mean, I'm doing this until I beat it. Because I feel like I actually have a chance, unlike Lady Butterfly. <laughs> Where I do not feel like I have a chance until I have much better upgrades. Like, I'm getting him to half hell. I just need to continue doing that. I want this prayer bead. Imagine if he doesn't give one after all of that. 
I say all of that like past tense, like I've already beaten him. All of this that I'm currently doing and hopefully will complete soon enough. <laughs> Round seven, fight! Okay, much better. Caught to health down. I'm, my, my control is definitely a bit balked, I think. Half health almost. This is going infinitely better. But I, yeah, this Makiri, I keep dodging when I'm not intending to, which is worrying. Shit. Shit, shit. Oh, he caught me in a fucking combo breaker then. Mate, I'm dead. <laughs> Stop it. Cease and desist. Okay, okay. Shit. <laughs> Have a drink, mate. I don't get another res, so I may as well just... Oh, yes. This one's so much better than the previous runs. Look at that, he's almost done. No. No, no. <laughs> Come on! He was so close. Oh, he was so close. He was so close. <sighs> I feel like I've got a bit better though. Man, who knew? that this guy was going to take so long. I was like, I'm a bit more pam pumped up. I've got a bit more uh, power than I did last time I was here. My attack power has gone from one attack power to two attack power. I can totally just wipe the floor with this dude. No. I don't remember how much fucking damage I was doing to him before, but I can tell you, if this is two attack power, then uh, I wasn't doing much damage to him before. That is my official take on the matter. Round eight. Fight! Watch me do a lot worse this time. Kick combos are brutal. And the fact that I have no idea where I am half the time, because he just backs me up against the fucking wall. Oh, this is horrible. 
the camera is absolutely dreadful in a confined area. Like, look at this. I can't see shit. I can't. I, I literally can't see shit. Wow. I was, I was moving around then. I was, like, trying to get out of there and I was just trapped in the corner. That is abysmal. That should not be able to happen. I was literally doing all I could to actually see what the hell was going on. But the camera would not allow me. Gonna go ahead and say that one doesn't count. Because <laughs> that was literally just down to bullshit camera. Oh, come on. Okay. Round eight. Two. <laughs> Fight. Damn it. Oh, what? You seriously rolled out the way of that? Cool. I love how all of your attacks are instant and mine have massive wind-ups. Very cool. Cool. It's the cool patrol. The cool patrol is here, and they say that it's very cool. Okay. My Makiri seems to be actually working now, which is a big improvement. Oh my god, it's posture. Fuck. Fuck, move. I can't see. Oh, this camera, man. It's absolute gash. Ah. Oh. I got his posture up really high then. If it wasn't for the fucking camera, I think I'd have had that. God damn it. How can you make a game like this? And then make fights in tiny fucking enclosed areas. Not like walls enclosed, but like bamboo enclosed and on the edge of a cliff so you can't move that way. And it's a pretty thin area and this guy moves around a lot so there's like almost no space to breathe. And then you put a camera in that cannot keep track of it all. That's not difficulty. This guy is a difficult enemy. But the camera makes it far more difficult than it should be. Round eight three. Fight.
Oh, come on. Oh, shit, me. Not the corner. Not the corner. Oh, it's so bad. Good, look at this camera. Where am I? I what is Oh the camera man? Come on. Okay, the actual hardest part of this fight is fighting the camera. Good shit. Very good. Very, very, very well made. I took at least half of my hits there because I wasn't sure where I was or where he was in relation to me because I couldn't fucking see. I know I could beat him. If only this was like an actual open area, we'd have had him already. Unfortunately. Oh, good. Just get up here. Unfortunately, they forgot to put this fight in a decent area. Whoops. Round eight, four. Fight! Good start. Oh, I dodged you fucking dickhead. My God. How does he punish so fast? Not the corner, not the corner. <gasps> I couldn't do anything. Once again. Once again, I just lost my life because of the shit camera because I couldn't see the fucking corner. Where is he? Oh my god. This is starting to create real- oh my god. This is starting to grate so badly. 
I was on a bit of a roll there, and then I get fucked into the corner, and so I lose. That's just it. Once you get put in that corner, you cannot win because you cannot see. And then you just lose your rhythm so that when you get back up, there's no chance. You're done. I know I can get him. I've got him so close. It's literally just luck when I don't get fucked into the corner. Okay. Round eight, five. Oh, and good. That time the Makiri doesn't work. That's some good shit if ever I've seen it. Oh, and that... Just kill me. Just kill me. Just kill me. I pressed the Makiri button. Nothing occurred. And then I dodged his sweep, which I know you're not supposed to dodge. You're supposed to jump sweeps, but still, every single time before now, I've dodged that sweep by pressing B, and he'd just get out of the way of the sweep. Because my dude has not the longest legs, but no! No, this time we're going to get hit by it. Sure thing, bud. Sure thing. Okay. Oh, piss off with that stupid double jump. I've got an idea, guys. Let's put a fucking hard fight in a dumb ass tiny area that should not have this fucking fight in it. And then, just to top it all off. Let's make the player wall jump with our really badly made wall jump mechanics just to reach it. There, see? You can dodge the sweep just like that. I'm probably teaching myself bad... bad tactics by repeatedly doing that. But it works, so... And it's like my default. Fuck yourself. Camera, what are you doing? <laughs> Shit me! If you get hit by one, if you get hit by one of those attacks, you get automatically locked into the full combo. Absolute madness. Oh, and again, I pressed Makiri and it didn't fucking work. This is so dumb. I'm literally just at the mercy of this fucking system right now. Will it do the thing I tell it to do? If answer is yes, score hit. If answer is no, lose fight. Cool. Oh, brilliant. And then that just one-shots me. Yeah. From pretty much full health to dead in a single kick. Very good. Very good. Very good indeed. My goodness.
I'm if this fucking prick does not drop a prayer beam I'm going to have to annihilate someone I'm going to end the recording instantly this prick does not drop a prayer bead when I kill him. Oh, let's dance. This one's going much better. Okay, I don't know what happened there, but I'll take it. Ah, shit. Spamming the dodge button is, is seeming very effective right now. Fuck. Oh my god, that one shot me. Eat a dick. I got him down to half health. Oh, fuck's sake. That was going so well at the start, man. Check how long this part has left. Uh, because that's how long until we beat him. <laughs> this part is not ending until this purple prick is dead. Let's see how angry I get in that time. Because it might not be for a while. Already uploaded a 70 minute part the other day. Me versus Lady Butterfly because I wasn't sure how much to leave in. Could have uploaded a 180 minute part, but I felt that was too much. But, uh, figured you'd want to see some of the fucking process. This time, let's try just leaving the entire thing in. All of my attempts. Let's see what people think about that. Ah, oh, eat me. Well, this is a dead run. Just kill me. is this going to take how long how long how long is this going to take how long how long
Here we go again. Here we go for the hundredth time. Cool. He didn't actually attack then when I when I click. Oh, cool. Very good. Okay. Again with the not blocking. My I'm pressing block and block is not occurring. What if we just spam the dodge button? Let's try that. Okay, that doesn't work. Good to know. Good to know. Good to fucking know. Dodge just works when it feels like it. Gotcha. Because sometimes you can dodge that shit. Other times you can't. And it's pure luck. Pure luck. Oh, that's good. If anything, I feel like this is maybe proof that people with Dragon Rot don't actually die. Because I died for three hours straight to Lady Butterfly. Three hours straight. It was probably like at least 20 deaths. Probably more. I don't know. I didn't count. And then I died once to the horse dude today. And then I've died like 10 times to this dude so far. And no one's died. Like, none of the NPCs with Dragon Rock. So, either it's a ridiculously high amount, or they just don't die. And if they don't die, then I'm curious what the point of it is, aside from the Unseen Aid gimmick. But, like, why have the characters get infected with this stuff if it doesn't actually... Oh, cool. So that time... That time it didn't work. hell. Oh, that combo, man. If he hits you with the first one, you are unable to do anything. It's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Oh, good. And I pressed Makiri. Once again, nothing happened. Once again, it's this Makiri counter, man. It does what it wants. I'd say the ratio of Makiri counter actually working to not working is like 20%, but my timing is the exact same every time. Like literally just before the attack hits. Like maybe half a second before the attack hits, I press it. And about 20% of the time, I do a Makiri counter. And about 80% of the time, he just sort of stands there and cops a hit. Yes, I obviously wanted to jump backwards. Good fucking job. Oh my Christ. Get up there, you shit ninja. God.
Oh, what? You have that much range? Fuck me. Okay, what is that shit? Actually unbelievable, man. Oh, this Makiri counter, I swear to Christ. I just let me heal, man. Like, literally, if the camera wasn't shit and if the Makiri counter actually worked when you press the fucking button, I would have done this fight maybe 30 minutes ago. But the camera is shit and the Makiri counter doesn't work 80% of the time, and so I have not. Oh my god, just cut the fucking bamboo. And if you panic spam the dodge button, you can't get a hit in after he does that. Feels bad. Fuck me. Oh my god, this shitting Makiri counter, man. Every fucking time. Every time I'm in with a chance, the Makiri counter comes in to just fucking ruin it by not working when pressed. And I know you're probably going to be in the comments like, you're just not timing it right, but I promise you I am. Like, I know the timing. I get the timing half the time. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant fucking heal there, prick. Oh, fucking excellent. Two brilliant heals in a row. Mummy would be proud. Half the time you can heal right in front of him and he doesn't do shit. But those two times, when it actually matters, those two times, he fucking disallows it. Good shit. fight is so fucking enraging. <laughs> it's 
See there, I panic dodged. Pressed it twice. Couldn't get a hit in. If I'd have pressed it once, that would have been a hit. Oh, once again. Once again. Once again. Death by fucking not working Makiri counter. I swear to God. Is it just bugged? Because I know the timing. Let's just fucking check that it is press it at the last second. Pretty fucking sure it is. Makiri counter. Use this to stomp on an enemy's winning. Yeah. Requires impeccable timing. Yes. Stomp on the sword. The moment an enemy thrust attack lands. Yes. Literally. Split second before. I am timing it fucking perfectly. Pinpoint timing every time. And the fucking dickhead just does not move. Every fuck. Well, not every time. Because occasionally it actually works like it's supposed to. But almost every time. He just stands there. Which is why I've started dodging. Even though you're not supposed to dodge. You're supposed to just fucking Makiri counter it. But it's so broken that dodging is more effective. Even though it shouldn't be. The entire point of the Makiri counter is to show... Oh, hey, this is better than dodging. But it just doesn't work. Oh, you're just not getting the timing right. No. If only you could see my button pushes. Presses. Pushes? Presses. You would understand how stupid this is. Got it that time. Oh, brilliant. Then he fucking hits me somehow. What? As if that missed. See, camera, camera! Stupid. Absolutely stupid. Why make this fight in such a small arena? The difficulty should not be in fucking camera controls. That should not be where the difficulty of this game lies. This dude isn't that difficult. And if the camera wasn't so bad and the Makiri wasn't so broken, I would have beaten him a long time ago. Okay, round 3486. Oh, good. I'm glad this fucking tree is just fucked. That's nice. Oh, it's fucking. Oh, piss off, man. 
It's absolutely unreal that you can't get two hits in. If you go for a second hit... Oh, hello. Fuck, I shouldn't have done that. There we go. Okay, you can dodge it. Oh my god. Mad. Okay, now I can't see. Okay, that worked out. Let's get out of that corner. He's at half health, and I haven't used too much. Oh my god, the Makiri's actually working this time. No. Fucking hell. No! Of course the one time the Makiri doesn't work. Can you please walk away faster? going so well. Fuck. I need one more heal. If I had five fucking healing gods, this would be a done deal. Mad. That went so well. I played perfectly. The Makiri counter worked three times. And still, he didn't fucking die. Absolutely insane. Pinpoint perfect fucking play from me. Dodged almost every single thing he threw at me. And he still sometime, somehow comes out on top. Oh, this is so horrible. Fucking, like, zoom the camera out when you're wall jumping or something to make it not that awful. Every time, he feels like he is easily beatable. Every time. Oh, I fucking dodged that. Excuse me? Sure, just kill me then. Just kill me. Like, Lady Butterfly actually feels difficult. This guy feels fine. It's literally just the camera and the controls fighting against you constantly. At least the run back isn't too bad. It takes, like, what, 20 seconds? And then clearing bamboo takes, like, another 10. Are you fucking joking? My good lord!
come off it. Fucking hell. Oh. Yes, man. Once again, I'm... Kill me. Just kill me. Once again, I was trapped in the corner. Unable to see. This part would have been going for nearly an hour now. That's good. Once again, it will not end until this prick is defeated. Oh my good lord. I'm pressing... Oh, fuck right off. I was pressing deflect. I was holding it down from long before he started moving towards me. Oh, fuck off. Why did I... I'm getting him real close. I've got him down two thirds. Like, a lot of times now. That was another two thirds, I think. 
It's just that last third. If I just had one more healing gourd, it'd be done. It'd be over. Once again, he doesn't start blocking when I click block. Oh, good. I guess fuck me then and fuck this run. Apparently, he just wasn't feeling like doing what I was telling him to this time. Got a couple of good deflects in there. Oh, good. I was stuck on the fucking shitting scenery. I can't see a fucking thing. Where is he? Oh, fucking hell. Oh my god, I pressed the fucking dodge button yet again. Fucking suck my cock. Choke it down. Every fucking time. Pretty, pretty much like 90% of these deaths are because I've taken damage due to the game not doing what I tell it to. Any, I, I must have taken damage pretty much every single run from either a Makiri counter failing or a dodge failing. The game just doesn't do what you tell it to so often, way too often. It really harms the experience. And when you're fighting with the camera on top of all that as well. Jesus Christ, man. Game needed another six months of cooking time at least before they released it. Good. I love how he's already posture broken me after about five seconds. Cool. I love how I can't fucking see anything. again. Suck me dry. What? I'm blocking. I don't believe this. And now I'm stuck on this fucking rock. Excellent. What a shit fucking designed area, man. Let's put a really fast-paced enemy in a really, really tight area. What could go wrong apart from the fact that we forgot to design a good camera? Me gets shoved into corner by enemy with no way to avoid it. 
enemy continues attacking because he has unlimited fucking everything. Rocks just happen to be there. Me cannot see the rocks because the camera is fucking ass. Death arrives. Ridiculous. I counter half his shit, but he's still just. It's because you still take posture damage even when you're deflecting. So even though I perfectly deflect him, I still take fucking loads of posture damage. And he can just annihilate it. Like that. Like, I perfectly defected three of those five hits. And yet, he still broke my posture. Because you still take the posture damage even when you're deflecting. Which is just ridiculous. Oh, time for another episode of I Can't Fucking Move. Wow. Brilliant. Love to be trapped in a corner. What a good fucking mechanic. corner traps sure are good aren't they yes let's have an enemy that has unlimited fucking attacks his poise seems to be infinite and let's have him just spam fuck you into a corner where there is literally no way to get out because even though you can jump you can't jump over enemies heads if they're trapping you in a corner because if you push towards them and do the jump you just do like the double jump on them and then back the way you came. There is no way to jump over their heads and out the corner. And you can't go through them, obviously. And because you're trapped in a corner, you can't go around them. So you're just fucked. Royally. Fisted. Straight up the asshole. Come <laughs> on. 
better. Let me move! I can't! Once again, I was unable to see where I was, whether I was up or down. Fucking anything, due to the shit camera. Unbelievable, man. This fight would have been over a year ago. Of course he's now immune to that. Fuck off. Oh, piss off. How in the fuck? I can't see! Brilliant. God, his health is so low. No. No, no. my mind. I'm gonna lose my fucking mind. He didn't have a health bar. We removed it. His health bar was fucking gone. And still, somehow, we die. Actual insanity, man. We literally removed it. There was no health bar left. I'm going to have to watch that one back. Because he literally had zero health. Like, that thing he did, did that mean that he gets, like, an extra hit point at death or something? Like, what the fuck? getting out of that one.
I'm off it. Well, I had to dodge there. The only option there was dodge because he was about to trap me in that corner, at which point you cannot win. So the only option was dodge. But dodge doesn't work either. The only option was dodge. Because if he traps you in the corner, you are literally unable to get out. Because he doesn't back off. Ever. He's got you trapped in a corner. He is not leaving. And you cannot go around him. You cannot go through him. And you cannot go over him. So you just have to deflect and deflect and deflect and deflect. And eventually you will miss one. And you die. And that is it. That is the entire, the entire breadth of possibilities once he catches you in a corner. Either die immediately, or die in five seconds. Come on, you blind fucking twat. Come on, come on, come on you bitch. Oh! Fucking Makiri counters, man. Oh, as if. As fucking if. What a joke. What a joke that that hit me. Oh, what a joke that didn't hit him. Christ! <gasps> Heal! Ridiculous. Absolutely fucking ridiculous. Absolutely fucking ridiculous. He traps me against a wall once again. The only thing I can do is die or heal. So I heal, but you can't out heal it because he can attack you faster than you can take a swig from your tiny little jug. <sighs> so the second, the second he trapped me against that wall, there were no options. Because if I heal, he just hits me and then I die anyway. And if I don't heal, then he hits me. And then I die anyway. I cannot believe this fight is not done when I literally killed him. I removed all of his health. And he did not die. Like three or four attempts ago, whenever it was. All of his fucking health removed.
Well, that's my favorite opener. Oh my god, as if that hit me. You must be joking. I'm not entirely sure what that thing he pops actually does. What the fuck? Prayer bead. Give me a prayer bead. No, not scrap iron. No! No way! Oh my god! No! All of that! And he doesn't drop a prayer bead! Thank you very much for watching. If you have enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe. It will help numb my pain. And if you've enjoyed this and the rage that came with it, then please share the video around, share the playlist around, if you can. I would really appreciate that. Oh my god. And I will see you next time. Thanks for watching.